There are three instruments that are powered by the pedostatic system. The airspeed indicator, the altimeter, and the vertical speed indicator, or VSI. The pitot tube faces the direction that the air flows from to give us our ram air pressure, and the static port faces 90 degrees from the airflow to give us our static air pressure. The airspeed indicator is the only instrument that uses both the pitot tube and the static port. It measures the ram air pressure and that gets compared to the static air pressure to give us our airspeed. The altimeter only uses the static port to measure your altitude. It uses aneroid wafers that expand as the static air pressure decreases and contract as the static air pressure increases to give us our altitude. The VSI works by measuring differential pressure using a diaphragm and a calibrated leak through a small hole. The small size of the hole restricts the airflow so it can't move through as fast as the diaphragm can move. This creates a pressure differential that causes the needle to move. If your pitot tube becomes blocked, only your airspeed indicator will be affected. If only the front is blocked, your airspeed will read zero. If the drain hole is also blocked, your airspeed would climb as your altitude increased and it would drop as your altitude decreased.